So uh, now we've got small tank in the footwell, right. big tank, my Mr. Tank, my buddy, yeah. um, selectable what fuel gauges. Wilson? Yeah, Wilson, the tank, I think it's got to be out here. got to be, yeah. yeah. Hopefully it'll be empty if I have to ditch, I can use it as a flotation <laughs> aid. Um, it's lighter than water anyway, isn't it? Yeah. Still float a bit. Oh well, yeah, a bit perhaps. Um, FMS keypad now, down yeah. there, so I can load, instead of, because I couldn't get to that knob on the right hand side where you load all the running airways and everything else. Right. I, Garmin kind of gave me that. That's what it'll do, that then it Yeah, so it's a keypad, I can put in, you know, go to, direct to, enter, exactly like, like the Airbus at work. Yeah. Um, this is booting up now. So, see no position at the moment. So you get a moving map there, and then you get the engine down there. Um, it's got terrain. It's got pretty much. It's a fantastic kit. It really is. And it's um, linked to the autopilot. Um, engine four row EGT, four row CHT, um, electrical. Uh, stuff. If you want to say lean the aeroplane, yeah, lean the engine, you just go to lean assist and then you can just get all the graphs up and lean it like a demon. Mm. Um, yeah, pleased actually. It's uh, it's coming on well, it's taken a lot of sorting out. Um, so how different from the Airbus is this now? <laughs> it's better. It's better. Not joking. <laughs> it's got a better kit in it. Every airway, every... Everything. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot. In fact, it's better than the Airbus. It's got things like a 2,000 nautical mile range scale. Whereas the Airbus only goes out to uh, 320. Yeah, but where's all the weather radar? Right um, that all comes in... Um... Nice. <laughs> <laughs> so, I was joking. Yeah, yeah, no, no. It's got a storm scope. You can... Um... Is that from satellite information? or? No, it's from... Uh... The little souped up M um, ADF. Uh, so it's in strike mode at the moment. If I went to cell, then it'll just identify cells you know, and you can navigate your way through it. Overlaid, obviously, because there's no GPS at the moment. You've got that overlaid over the map and the terrain and everything else. So you can see it. And it comes off that aerial there. Superb. <laughs>